I just picked these up, picked this up. This is a 37 piece. It's a combination impact socket set of 3 8 and half inch drive. It says it's got high visibility, easy to read markings. It's black oxide coating, preventing rust, chrome palladium construction, 3 8 and half inch adapters, 3 8 by 3 inch adapter, 3 half inch by 3 inch extension. So it's got two extensions for 3 8 sockets. They're going to be 8, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 17, 5 16. 3 8 7 16 half inch 9 16 5 8 11 16 and 3 quarter now why couldn't they just make this a 40 piece or whatever and go 14 15 16 and 17 maybe even 18 and 19 but okay oh we got the 5 16 3 8 7 16 half inch 9 16 5 8 11 16 3 quarter so they're they got that in a run they could have gone maybe 13 16 and 7 8 but let's see where we pick up in the half inch half inch we have 9 10 12 no 11 but we have the 11 and the 3 8 13 14 15 so they gave me the 15 no 15 3 8 so give me 15 here there should be a 16 that I would want to see here but 17 now we jump I don't know why we don't go 19, 18, 19, 20, but 21 and 22 millimeters. Okay, now 7 16 half inch, 9 16 5 8 11 16 3 quarter, 13 16, 7 8, 15 16, and 1 inch. All right, well, at least for the SAE, it looks like they tried to cover most of their sizes. Let's see what's in the box. All right, so it's got this case. They all seem to sit in a great tight end here. Anything rattling around? But this is going to be rotting in my service van. It's going to be probably more used when I'm working on generators than it will be for my air conditioning and heating work, and even when I work on cars. But professionally, I don't work on cars. I'm a backyard mechanic. So this is more for, for if I'm going to be using professional for generator repair work. Some HVAC stuff. So in this set, the largest socket is a one inch. I don't have a good set of impacts. So I figure why beat the hell out of my regular ones when I can get some impacts. I mean, they look pretty nice. I'm not sure how well they're going to work. Let's go over the sizes that I just got. So, as you can see, it starts with a 3 quarter for a 3 eighths. You have 11 sixteenths, 5 eighths, 9 sixteenths, half inch, 7 sixteenths, 3 eighths, 5 sixteenths. Now, on the metric, I'm getting an 8, a 10, 11. They're missing 9. Then 12, 13, 14. No 15 or 16, but then I get 17. See, that's not a deal breaker for me. Because I have, I definitely have a 15, and I may even have a 16. Picked up a 3 quarter. Looks pretty nice. That's going to half inches. All right, they're starting me at eight. So I mean, you can see the number on it. It says Pittsburgh on it. CRV for the metal it's made out of. Now, the way they did this was half inch on this side. It looks like, yeah, half inch drive on this side to three quarters. So you got half inch, nine sixteenths, you got five eighths, eleven sixteenths, three quarter. Then you're coming up to thirteen sixteenths, seven eighths, fifteen sixteenths, and one. So I mean, that's not a bad 
selection. They're pretty much giving you most of the sizes there. Now when we come into metric, we got 9, 10, no 11, but we have an 11 here. 12, 13, 14, 15, so they gave me the 15, 17. So that's where we stop here. So now there's no 18, 19, 20. Then we start 21, 22. At least this gives me quite a bit of sockets to start off with. Then they gave me, oh, they gave me a 7 16th. Look at that. So they gave me a 7 16th. So we're starting 7 16th, half inch, 9 16th, 5 8. That's actually pretty good because they're giving you most of the sizes here. Now in the metric, yes, they skipped the 11. And then they skipped quite a few here. A little disappointing. But I mean, here I'm pretty happy with the standard sizes I just got. You know what? Then they gave me a half inch, I mean a 3 8 extension. And they gave me a half inch extension. Then they gave me an adapter from 3 8 to half inch. comes with this nice little case so I can keep it in my van and drive around with it and it should hopefully stay in place I don't know how good it's going to stay in place I will find out but it doesn't really rattle around too much in its case I'm not going to say that the set is amazing. I'm not going to say it sucks. I don't have any idea of the quality of it. But, I mean, this is a new tool and in my toolbox for now to get going. pretty good I don't know how well they'll hold up but they do look pretty good I look forward to using them and like I said I bought these so I wouldn't have to use my own personal well my standard sockets that are not made for impact as I want to start using more impacts and stuff like that making it easier on a lot more of my repairs I'll be back in the future with a review to tell you what I think of this Pittsburgh set. 